I was dealing with a guy one time, and let me tell you, I got so upset that I literally went home, I got a pen and a paper, pen and a paper, and I said, dear this nigga's mama, <laughs> no, I'm serious. <laughs> I said, dear this nigga's mama, how did you anticipate the life of your son? Was it one where he reaches for the sky but skips over and gets the sun leaving darkness on everyone cause his ass is too greedy? <laughs> Never realizing he's so needy because of the daddy that got off of raising someone so damn freely. Now, here his ass is diving in pussy like it's his only lifeline, discarding one woman at a time cause he can't make up his mind. See, drama has been his only <clears throat> fashion sense cause pussy has been his only advocate and his mama, well, his mama never knew how to raise a man. See, it was a man just like him who got to you. Why didn't you think to ever break that cycle? Oh, I know, I know, I know, I know. Cause a man is gonna be what a man is gonna be, right? Well, maybe if you never let your son be your man, he might have been all right. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm just saying. <laughs> he might have been all right. Having to protect. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, maybe if you never let your son be your man, he might have been all right. Having to, <laughs> having to protect and provide, hold you up, but no other man would see. You looked at your son for everything he would have never understood. Of course he loves you, puts no one above you. But did you know that deep down his soul is filled with hate? All these feelings are misplaced. His childhood was erased and in order for him to know his name. He needs some woman to scream it so that he is no longer numbed and living in vain. Not knowing all the pain that remains started with the monster mommy made. Your son thinks he's being a man now. See, he was all you had. Every mistake didn't matter. Every heart he broke, fractured and shattered was just another daily tragedy. And why would you care when his daddy did the same to you? That nigga left you bitter, but instead you ensured you was going to be all right. Knowing as a single black woman, you was going to keep this ship tight and give life your very best fight. To be honest, I'm not even mad at you. <laughs> nah, I'm lying. <laughs> but see, I had to be the one to point out the many wrongs. See, I was raised to care and offer those hindered peace of mind. Now I know life ain't never been kind, but I'll be damned if another son gets raised to think that he can creep up on my daughter to take what doesn't belong to him. Coerce her into believing he's her friend, then go for the kill to leave her labeled as a bitter black bitch when she just wanted to love him. Teach your son to love and respect women, not to be the man that his daddy never was because you can't get that man back. So make his son someone a woman can trust and love. Signed, a good-ass woman. Yeah. <laughs>